expression is it's not taking any pictures. Today we welcome our bride and groom, Pop and Anne, and by video, families and friends, and we welcome you to Will and Sarah's home here in Queenstown. It's been wonderful to catch up with the family. I cannot believe it's over a year since we stood amongst the Amersfield vines on a beautiful summer day and celebrated your marriage, Will and Sarah. And now we're going to witness another wedding in the family, that of Bob and Anne. And we are truly delighted that you returned to Queenstown to share this occasion. You are a very entertaining couple who have travelled far. We can appreciate that you decided to leave the chills of the UK and have your ceremony here in Queenstown. And I'm sure you will never regret choosing this place for your wedding venue. And it is a beautiful day, isn't it? We knew it would Wonderful. be. This is an occasion to celebrate, and I'm sure you will do so in good heart, but never forgetting the family and friends who are not able to be sharing this day and with you. Share the good wishes and toast when you return to the UK, and show them photos of our glorious scenery and wonderful activities. Today, you're about to take a big step in cementing your relationship and formally committing yourselves to each other. Marriage is a gift in which husband and wife are united in heart, body and mind. And in their union, they fulfill their love for each other. Marriage means that each partner will help and support the other. It means the sharing together of joys as well as sorrow. And it has grown together in a closer and richer bond of love. We are proud that you have decided to enter into this union and to let us be part of it. I'm going to read a nice poem called Friendship. It is often said that it is love that makes the world go round. However, without doubt, it is friendship. It keeps our spinning existence on an even keel. True friendship provides so many of the essentials for a happy life. It is the foundation on which to build an enduring relationship. It is the mortar which binds us together in harmony. And it is the calm, warm protection we sometimes need when the world outside seems cold and chaotic. True friendship holds a mirror to our foibles and failings. Without destroying our sense of worthiness, true friendship nurtures our hopes. It supports us in our disappointments and encourages us to grow to our best potential. Bob and Anne came together as friends. Today they pledge to each other not only their love, but also the strength, warmth, and most importantly, the fun of true friendship. is a commitment to life, the best that two people can find and bring out in each other. It offers opportunities for sharing and growth that no other relationship can equal. It is a physical and an emotional joining that is promised for a lifetime. Within the circle of love, marriage encompasses all of life's most important relationships. A wife and a husband are each other's best friends, confident, lover, teacher, listener, and critic. Marriage deepens and enriches every facet of life. Happiness is fuller, memories are fresher, commitment is stronger. Even anger is felt more strongly and passes away more quickly. Marriage understands and forgives the mistakes life is unable to avoid. It encourages and nurtures new life 
new experiences, into new ways of expressing a love that is deeper than life. When two people pledge their love and care for each other in marriage, they are, a spirit, are a spirit unto themselves which binds them closer than any spoken or written words. Marriage is a promise, a potential made in two hearts of two people who love each other and takes a, a lifetime to fulfill. And now in the presence of your witnesses, I will ask you both to declare your commitment to each other. Other men, have you come here freely and without reservation to give yourselves to each other in marriage? Yes, yes we have. Very good. And I ask you Bob. Bob, will you share with Anne a relationship of love, tenderness and laughter? Will you stand by her through all her tomorrows? respecting her as a person, her individuality, her needs, her changes, and enjoying her love through all of her life together. I will. And Anne, will you share with Bob a relationship of love, tenderness, and laughter? Will you stand by him through all his tomorrows, respecting him as a person, his individuality, his needs, his changes, and enjoying his love when you are not doing your life together. I will. Now we're going to say your vows, and you're going to repeat them ever so slowly after. So hold hands and look at each other. to grow along with you. I promise to grow along. Be willing to face changes. Be willing to face changes. As they arrive. As they arrive. Keeping our relationship alive. Keeping our relationship alive. And also exciting. And also exciting. I promise to hold you in the highest respect. I promise to hold you in the highest respect. To honor you. As you so deserve, as you so deserve for the rest of my life. For the rest of my life. If you live to be a hundred, if you live to be a hundred, I want to live to be a hundred. Minus one day. I want to live to be a hundred minus one day. So I never have to live without it. I never have to live without it. Never have to live without it. Keeping our relationship alive, keeping our relationship alive and excited and excited. I promise to hold you, I promise to hold you in the highest respect, and honor you as you so deserve, and honor you as you so deserve for the rest of my life. If you live to be a hundred, if you live to be, I want to live to be a hundred. Minus one day. I want to live to be minus one day. 
I promise to be with you and for you. I promise to be with you and for you. To share my joys. To share my joys. As well as my sorrows. As well as my sorrows. To share my life. To share my life. My feelings, my hopes. My feelings, my hopes. And my dreams. And, my dreams. and to love you for you. I give you this ring as a symbol of that peace. I promise to be with you and for you. I promise to be with you and for you to share my joys, to share my joys, as well as my sorrows, as well as my sorrows, to share my life, to share my life, my feelings, my hopes, my feelings, my hopes, and my dreams with you, and my future, and to love you forever, and to love you forever. I give you this ring, I give you this ring, as a symbol of that promise. Marriage is a joining of two lives, the blending of two hearts. Bob and Anne, today your lives have been joined in marriage. Now and forever, may both of you have your lives filled with joy and happiness. Share your thoughts and dreams. May you find comfort and security in each other. May there be absolute trust, caring and sharing. May the love that you share for each other today continue to grow more deeply. Now and forever, may you find your true contentment as husband and wife. And now I will pronounce Bob and Anne by the authority invested in me. I now pronounce you to be husband and wife. On behalf of us here today, I extend to you our love and support. May your relationship flourish and grow throughout